Today in this video, I will show you how you can add AOS animation in your Angular project. So let's see how to add. So for that, first of all, I will open a, another tab, and here I will just type AOS animation, and this is the official side of AOS animation. So I will open this link, and I will provide the link in description also. And here is the animation when I will scroll, it will be animated our element. So I will add this in our Angular project. So to add this. First of all, I have to install this package. So here I will scroll and now you can see the installation command. So if you using yarn, so you can add this command. Uh, so here I will write this command npm because I am using Angular. So I will copy this command and I will open our Visual Studio code and here is the terminal. So in this terminal, our project is running on local server 4200. So to install this command, so I have to open another terminal. So here is the new terminal, and here just I will paste our command and I will paste enter to install. So now you can see it's installing, install completely. And now I will decrease the terminal size. And we know when we installed any package they, that are stored into the node modules folder. So here is the node modules folder. And you can see AOS animation installed. And now I will open this AOS animation. And here is a dist folder. And you can find here AOS.CSS. So I have to add this link in our angular.json file. So here is the angular.json file which I already opened. So here I will add this link in our styles array because I am adding a CSS link so for that I am adding this in our styles array so inverted comma and note hyphen modules slash AOS so AOS slash inside this AOS folder you can see here this folder so dist slash AOS dot CSS and comma to separate this line and press Ctrl S to save. And when we install any package, we know we have to restart our server, otherwise, it will be, it will be not add. So, and so for that, so I will go to my previous terminal where our project is running. So, to restart, first of all, we have to terminate. So, I will press Ctrl C to terminate and Y for yes, and now again i will run so ng search and now you can see it's compiled successfully so now again i will go to the browser and aos animations official site and here i will scroll and you can see how to initialize so here I have to add this line in our post. I will copy this AOS in it. So this line and I have to add this line where I want to add AOS animation. So I want to add AOS animation in our home component all the H on tag. So to, for that first of all I will go to the home component the TS file and here into the ng on in it. Here is the ng on in it. So I will copy paste this aos animation so after adding this line you can see here the error is showing cannot find name aos because i didn't import this aos animation so i have to import here so first of all here is the import and a o s from inverted comma aos and you can see AOS is capital because here is the capital and now you can see the, it's removed the error and now I will press Ctrl S to save and now I will go to the browser and now I will add the AOS animations attribute so here is the different types of animation fade up fade down so now here I will add a, this first one so I will copy this 
and in our HTML file here just I will add and again I will scroll so I will add this fade left and I will add this another h1 tag and here is the different types of animation flip so I will add this So here is the another property data AOS duration that means how long the animation is going on. So I will add this in our home. So as the different types of another property data AOS duration and data AOS offset now I will press ctrl s to save and I will go to the browser so now if I scroll so you can see it's animated You can see it's animated. So, hope guys, this video is helpful for you. And if you like this video, then please share, comment, and if you want to get more videos in Angular, so please subscribe and press the notification bell icon also.